Hello. In this video, let us discuss the equation based on a uh, concept of averages. The question is, in a class of 540 students, for every 9 girls, there are 11 boys. So, let's try to solve it simultaneously. So, there are total 540 students. Out of which the ratio of girls and boys is 9 ratio 11. So, if we simplify, we distribute girls and boys, we will get the number of girls as 243 and boys as 297. Fine. Uh, I have simply distributed this 540 in 9 ratio 11. Fine. Further, the weight of student varies from 40 to 50 kg. There are 40, as many 44 kg girls as there are 46 kg boys. So, here we have two weights information 44 kg and 46 kg. So, let, let me write it down here. So, 44 kg, the girls are, the 46 kg ke boys. Hai. 46 kg ke boys. Suppose the number of girls of 44 kg is x. So number of boys of 46 kg is x. Okay. And further, as many 40 kg boys as 50 kg girls. So two more weights: 40 kg and 50 kg. So as many 40 kg boys as many 40 kg boys. Let it be y. As 50 kg girls, so ye bhi y hoga, right? The number of 50 kg boys is 35 more than that of 44 kg girls. So we have x 44 kg girls. So the number of boys of 50 kg is 35 more than x. It must be x plus 35 then. Fine. And uh, while there are as many 44 kg boys as 46 kg girls, 44 kg boys as 46 kg girls. So let this be z. Right. Now, the ratio of 40 kg boys and girls is 4 ratio 3. 40 kg boys or girls ka jo ratio hai, that is 4 ratio 3. So, since this is y over here, so I can simply substitute 3 by 4 of y. This ratio ho jayega 3 ratio 4 ka. Or, kyunki boys to girls ka dera 4 ratio 3 ka. Right? And that of 50 kg girls and boys is 1 ratio 3. 50 kg girls or boys ka ratio is 1 ratio 3. So, from here we can say that y upon x plus 35 is 1 ratio 3. Or solving will get 3y is equal to x plus 35. This is our first equation. Further, the total of this must be equal to 243. So this is x plus z plus 7 by 4 of y. x plus 7 by 4 of y plus z must be equal to 243. Right. And the total of this must be equal to 297. So we have 2x plus y plus z plus 35. So 2x plus y plus z plus 35 is equal to 297. Now do one thing. Let us uh, subtract equation 2 from equation 3. Equation 3 may say, hum to go subtract kar We will get x y minus 7 by 4 of y is minus 3 by 4 of y. z is z cancel out ho jayega. 35 means koi number yaha minus nahi that is 35 only. And 297 minus 243, which is how much? 54. On further solving it, we'll get x minus 3 by 4 of y is equal to how much? 19. Fine. And from here, if we substitute the value of x, which is 3y minus 35. So 3y minus 35 minus 3 by 4 of y is equal to 19. Or yahan par yadi hum isko solve kare, to 35 idhar le jate hain, to that will become 54. And 3 by me se uh, ye minus karte hain, so this will become 12 minus 3, 9 by 4 of y. 9 se ye 6 cents pe cancel hota hai. The value of y comes out to be 24. And if y is 24, we can simply easily find x as well. So x, if we substitute the value of y in this particular equation, we get x is 37. And since x and y dono ki value mil gai, we can easily find the value of z as well now. So let us try to find out the value of z also. So substituting in this particular equation, 2x that is 74 plus 24 plus z plus 35 is equal to 297. Fine. Or yaha se, yadi hum z ki value calculate karte, to kitna 297 minus 74 minus 24 and minus 35. So, Z will come out to be how much? 100 and 
64. This is the value of that. So this was a basic question based on equations, right? How many volts? Now we can, uh, you know, simply answer all these questions. How many boy weighs 40 kg? So boy is 40 kg is y. Y is 24. How many girls weighs 44 kg? 44 number of girls weighing 44 kg is x. X is 37. How many girls weigh 46 kg? Z. Z is 164. The number of boys weighing 50 kg is boys weighing 50 kg is x plus 35. X was 37, so the total becomes 72. Number of girls weighing 40 kg is 3 by 4 of y. So 3 by 4 of 24, that is 18. And the number of students weighing 50 kg, 50 kg ke total number of students is x plus y plus 35. So we have uh, 24 plus 37 plus 35. So 74 plus 24 is 96. So this was an easy question based on equations. Thank you.